Okay. Uh, tips? Do you have any tips, bird? Do not die! <laughs> <laughs> Best information, bird. Thank you. All right, so what can we craft? We have some new stuff. Copper ore, timeless metal. Attacks are faster. Okay, let's make a money hammer. I got a fast mash hammer. Well, I guess we he don't. Has the apple. Oh. Time to go back. The apple is in Ivan's hands. Ivan's hands. He feels the strength pouring through it. He's heading back towards the village. Okay, so this is a hammer that I actually want to use in melee. Hmm. Bit disappointing, but oh well. Oh, let's go back to this guy for a second. Greetings, Intre Okay, so what can I buy? What I for you today. Beating heart, golden clover. None of these are really what I'm looking for. So those are actually equipable, equipable talismans, but I don't really need them. Watch out for luck. It's been kind of bad. It'll get worse. Only so much I can do about it, but that's okay. The blacksmith? Here? How dare you! I told you to be gone! A new quest! I'm ready for a new quest! The old one is complete. A new quest? Surely you, you didn't bring me strength beyond measure. Does such a thing really exist? And can it be given to another? I'm special. No one else could have found it. Only Ivan the blacksmith. Now, show me. What did you bring? The golden apple. Whoever holds it in his hands has strength beyond measure. Try it and you will see. Prove it. Give me that apple. Now! Your fake apple. Take this apple, Tsar. You will feel its strength. See? It is just an apple. It might be golden, but it does nothing else. Wait. I feel something. I am strong. The power is real. Cross. Uh, ahem. Ivan, you have done well, but I have yet one more task for you. You must go far away, as far as the eye can see. Find bottled youth and bring it to me. Being young and smart is my speciality. I will make you the same. Very well, you do that. Or forever leave this Tsardom. Go, and do not return until you bring back bottled youth, or I will cut off your head. Oi. I like Yvonne. I like dumb Yvonne. <laughs> he is an effective liar. No one Yvonne, believes him. My dear boy. That wretched Tsar. You did what he asked, and he is sending my boy away again. Instead of finding a wife, you will go to Baba Yaga again, no? I will go, but what gifts should I give her? Hmm. She doesn't like receiving the same gift twice. I remember someone telling me. Yes, bring her a white cow's tail and a sack of spoiled grain. White cow's tail? You think the herdsman will just give me his cow's tail? It doesn't hurt to ask Ivan. Find him in the cow pen. He's there all day long. Spoiled grain? Everyone throws out spoiled grain. Where can I find a sack of it? Talk to the wheat cutter. I heard her cursing the Vedmak for spoiling her crops. Just what you need. 
I'll talk to them. Thank you, Baba, for your advice. Get those gifts and go back to Baba Yaga. She will help you. Take this bread as well. Oh, you're all skin and bones after all these travels. Oh, and the Undertaker is looking for you. Go talk to him. Take care not to get lost in the swamp. And come home when you're hungry. And remember, Ivan, look out for a wife. I would love to see my sweet boy married. Ivan, dearest, woe unto me. My wheat all cut from one side to the other. A terrible omen, blacksmith. I ran away as soon as I saw it. I'm too afraid to stay there now. Superstitions. But why let an old saying ruin your day? Better safe than sorry. And the tales I know, <laughs> they're not for the faint of heart. Bad things keep happening since that filthy bad Mac arrived. I bet he is behind this. Spoiled grain. I filled some sacks with it, but it's all useless now. Why? You want some? I do. Just one sack. That's all I need. Let's make a deal. You find you was guilty, and I'll give you three sacks of spoiled grain. Where is he? Where's the Vedmac now? Heaven knows, Ivan. He may still be in the fields. I'm too scared to confront him. They say he's a powerful sorcerer. Oh, be careful. These children are gnomes. The kind-hearted Green Emperor, or the foul Red Emperor? The Tsar? Um, the Tsar? A visitor from the foreign land? The Emperor will surely want to talk to you. Lower the bridge! Of course, right after I take back this coffin lid you stole. Hey! That was our castle bridge! Yoink. Not anymore. I have to return it to its owner. Oh. The, uh, the Undertaker's over here. The problem with how banging this music is, is sometimes I just don't say anything, because I'm just listening, because it's so good. Say, Vlad, have you noticed how it all seems too quiet lately? Our beloved group of chatty drunkards by the tavern... People saw them wander off into the woods. But it has been days, and darker thoughts loom about. Well then, into the woods I go. Not so fast, lad. I would prepare for the worst. Take this. If their fate has already been sealed, well, then you know what you have to do. And one more go to the priest and ask for his blessing. Godspeed, lad. Do I have to? Okay, doesn't look like I have to. Well, now we got a shovel for hands. You've coffin lid. I believe this belongs to you. My lid. Tell me the truth, neighbor. You stole it. Found it. I found it by uh by the river. Ah! Do you think I can't spot a liar just because I'm dead? Be gone! Well time to just bull man away. Okay, uh, so the other one was the, the cowherd over here. Uh, well, this seems like a problem. I'm ruined! This village is cursed! I am cursed! What happened here? A foul beast has slaughtered my cows. All but one, my smallest and dearest. 
my little white princess. Ivan, you are a strong man. I beg you, find her before it's too late. Without her, I'm doomed. I've nothing left in this world. You have me. Don't worry, you'll always have me. Woe unto me, my poor critters. <laughs> Pull yourself together, old man. I'll go there right away. Bring my white lady back to me. She's my light. Please hurry. The living dirt ball shall shall, <laughs> shall find what you ask. As that is what I am. That is what I do. Okay, uh, let's see. This person seems new. The peasant seems to be sound asleep. <laughs> Well, never mind. Not useful. Alright, off we go. So I want to mess around here a little bit more. I can make a shovel. Dig up buried stuff or dig yourself a hole for protection. Using the shovel is less tiring. It doesn't seem like that's really that helpful. And I could get a better chain fork. I'm not really sure if I care for these things. I'll probably just save for hammers. Uh, let's just keep going. Ivan seems troubled. Where is he going now? Let's see. Oh. So yeah, got to go to the farmlands and got to go to the woods. Let's go to the woods, change the scenery. I've been in the farmlands a little bit too much. I think this will be my last uh, last run for this this episode session. Let's see whatever. Where this road takes me. It does seem like we're seeing. Oh. Well, I certainly appreciate the fact that we are just gaining money periodically from these guys. That's that's going to solve some problems. Is that some kind of weird horror meat baboon? Oh god. I think it's supposed to be like a wolf man, but it looks like a baboon. Okay, let's smack it around. But yeah, this is gonna solve my financial woes pretty quickly. Just, uh... Just money hammer. I can't wait until we get the multi-hit hammer. Or, there's a multi-hit hammer and there's also a chain lightning hammer. Both of those are amazing, especially if I combo them together. A time-worn altar barely holding together. Dedic okay, let's keep Something praying. Fell on the, the altar is now... I will just continue to pray, because the... I don't know if the Perun horns are good but everything else seems like it's just going to give me bad luck. Okay. I'd like to go for the boars. What I should do is run around for a smidge, though. I keep reading that the Copex is Kronks, and I'm like, oh, I want to play more Outer, Wa Outer Worlds. I haven't had time since I got back. Yeah. have time in a day or two. Part of my problem is I keep like going out and doing stuff every single day or just squandering my my day so I, I need to like focus on other things which is bad. Okay what's this man want? Greetings blacksmith. The almighty god has made our paths cross. What? Greetings. I'm afraid I don't understand. You have been tasked to bury the dead, have you not? My business is my own, and I am hopeful to find them alive. Alas, I am afraid you are too late for that. This part of the forest is filled with beasts. But you need all the help you can get. 
Don't be foolish. Heed my warning. Trust the village priest. Wait, what? Oh. Eh, bless me. Bless me, father, so I may lay them to rest. God, please help your humble slaves. All those peasants with no graves. Let this common man be blessed, so he may put their souls to rest. Thank you. Go with the Lord, blacksmith. Still don't know what blessings do. Well, I don't seem to be cranking up any bad luck here, so maybe I'm okay. Let's see. Yep, so there's a there's something down here. Maybe. Let's see. Next win or lose gets you a boon. Yeah. Uh, so we already had one of those earlier. Uh, earlier, the witches had asked, uh, had asked like, what has uh, Yvonne learned? And I, I went with plus one mind, which I have no idea what plus one mind even, even means in the context of gameplay. Because there's like mind, fate, and something else, but until we actually get like those stats quantified, heck if I know. But I'm, I'm just going to assume we're going to get another one of those as soon as we're done here. I kind of wish we had gotten it earlier, uh, just because then we'd actually go back to learning throughout this level, but it doesn't matter that much. Nice thing is, uh, because this game is somewhat uh, roguelike-ish, roguelite-ish, when I die, I get sent back to the beginning, and uh, it gives me the opportunity to learn more, there which is nice. Not far off from the dead body. Bury without goods, bury with goods. Bury without I goods. To use them wisely. May you depart in peace. Ice's grave filled with birds. Now to find the other two. This is concerning. Why would you put birds in there? Corpse seems to have some wine on him. Barry. Better not touch his things. We don't want to upset the dead. I looted the other guy. May your soul be laid to rest. I wonder where the last one is. Presumably this way. Yup. The last drunkard lies dead. Give Kopex and Barry. Here, you'll need these in the afterlife. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. What? Why is there wind down there? It is done. Well, all right. That was confusing. Well, net loss, but that's okay. I got the hammer that makes me money, so I don't really care too much. Go. Help! Oh, nothing else from this guy. Onwards! We've entered the low, the domain of the smacksmith and his money hammer. What say you, beastie? Will you resist, or will you give me cash? Yeah, we another silver fork, which I'm pretty sure I don't need those. I don't think I really liked the effect of those. Eventually, we'll get the really good stuff. And I can't wait. Yeah, look at all that money. Giving giving away Copex is a lot less of a problem when uh, when you just get cash left and right. Eventually, I'll probably have to think about this more. What if I can just get multiple golden teeth on a hammer? Just be like, Geesh. cash, cash blaster. 
First we started as, as the poop smith. And now we're we are cash blaster. What else is there? Actually on that topic, I can't imagine I there's a whole lot of people that would know an answer to this, but is Math Blaster still a thing? Or have those games kind of come and gone? Like, I'm effectively attached to the entertainment, uh, I mean, the gaming industry, but edutainment and, like, educational games are one of those things that I, like, I know absolutely nothing about. Oh! Okay, we're getting smacked around a little bit here. Getting cornered is brutal. I think that, that one guy in the back is healing. The thing is, I'm fine with that. Win or lose here. I'm getting Copics aplenty. And they don't disappear, so I'll take what I can get. I should probably get my stamina back, though. I wonder if the bear gets resurrected as well. Give me cash. Now if only if only they dropped materials periodically as well. Boy, that would be that'd be the height of convenience as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, so it looks like the the weird flesh baboon, uh necro baboon, uh will actually just revive the other guy. I should probably kill him. Just we're not here for forever, but still. Well, I'm going to have a lot of Copex by the time I'm done, which is part of the reason why I chose this strategy. I did take some hits there, though. I might have to, I might have to chow down on some bread. Maybe, well, we'll see how it goes. This looks like a, oh, it's this guy. Greetings, uh, interested in some talismans? <laughs> What's he got? Here's what I have for you today. Okay, broken cross piece, more damage to ghost. Grow slime damages hit enemies for a short time, or dodges are longer. Okay, if we can get up to 150, those clipped wings sound like they'd be really, really handy. Oh, I see. They're they're a summoner. This is a problem. I mean, somewhat of a problem. I, I was worried I wasn't... Okay, we gotta, we gotta get my stamina back before I do too much. But yeah, I was worried I was, wasn't going to be able to get up to... Ow! To 150 uh, opex before I'm done. That clearly isn't too much of a problem. I just have to be very wary of those bat beasts. Problem is the bat beasts are going to be difficult to isolate here. I'm just gonna slowly chuck my hammer through these guys. Okay, got one of them. Or, not got one of them, I'm just hitting him. Just staying at just the right range. And they're not getting healed. He's... die? Well, I don't know. I only hope... He doesn't get up to 150 before I'm done. I mean, the accounting looks like it's good. 
So we'll see. We'll see where it lands. Okay. Just have to be concerned. Because I know these weird bat horrors do a busted amount of damage. Okay, there, there goes one. And it looks like one of the baboon? The baboon shaman says... Oh, no. Well, maybe. Okay, there we go. Wow! Yeah, that does like 100 damage. Oh, I did actually manage to kill one of the baboon summoners. Okay, let's get willpower back. How much am I at? Matt, I'm just shy, I think. We're gonna wander around. Because if I can get the, uh... Oh, no. We are very far off of just shy. Is it just... Is it just like a Cyclopean wolf horror with a meat belt? Is that what's going on here? I think that's what's... That's what I'm looking at. It was just really kind of hard to tell. Yeah, it's just a weird one-eyed wolf monster with a belt full of meat that it's using to heal the other wolf monsters. That's strange. But yeah, I've got infinite money this way, which is really nice. I don't really know what you're supposed to, like... Greetings. It feels imbalanced, Here's but then again, money... Today. Your income in this game is kind of bad, so I don't know. Great. wings. Let's hope that's an actual, like, uh, trinket. It is. Oh, Cloth of Longing. Okay. Uh, let's see. So we got a lot of stuff. I'm pretty happy with everything. Whoa! Boy! Gotta go fast! I wonder if I can actually have multiple of these. I'm faster than the camera at this point. Whoops, that's the treasure chest. Well, this is certainly going to make uh, adventuring and avoiding stuff a lot easier. Stuck. Avoid the turd beast. If I can. Okay. Is it dead? It was healing for a second there. Oh! It might have been healing off of the corpse. Or Pigsley here. Wait, so the bird's just bringing in other people and other things. That's hilarious. Okay. Yeah, I honestly can't wait until we can get some of the uh, the better equipment here. Uh, there's there's some really good stuff later. What is? Oh, that's a treasure chest, isn't that? Or no, that was a treasure chest, but it it broke. Got it. Um. But yeah, I can't wait until we get some of the better pieces of equipment and upgrade materials and whatnot. Because some of them get really busted, especially for dealing with groups. Currently, you know, I'm just doing single target or, or strike through damage. Which, it works, but it's, um... It's not as good as I would like it to be. really want to kill those or bat monsters because they're the only thing that presents much of a threat here especially now that I am I'm roll man McGillicuddy because everybody else is just uh they just follow me and they just die and is a thing of beauty Give 
me more body. Body parts. I don't think I really get body parts off of the these guys. I'm not even really sure if body parts are really worth worth it. That's okay. Eh. Come on. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, actually that that didn't do nearly as much damage. Let's get willpower back. Yeah, if I want to remake this hammer, I think I'd specifically go for the longer range as opposed to the faster attacking. Because the faster attacking isn't even helping in the slightest. Whoops. They're heading me off a little bit. I don't know. I don't appreciate that. Ow, ow, whoop. Bap, spap. That's okay. But the problem is the bats are not the most aggressive at following me around. Nor do I want them to be. But, like... It means I'm pretty much just going to be harried by the, uh... The wolf beasts. And slowly killing the other ones. I guess I could go for the summoners, but... I mean, this works. I was just... Ow! Whoa! I'll admit, I didn't actually even see him there. And they like to hide around corners, too, which is... Ugh. Probably let my stamina come back a little bit before I do too much more. Uh, let's see, are we down? We're not a we're not down a weird baboon. Guess I could go through the center at this point. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna start hitting the summoner. Because the summoner, the summoners don't actually heal the bats. Bap, snap. Okay, didn't hit me too much. They absolutely heal the bats. Ah. Well, conversely, they don't heal each other. Which I guess is my, which is actually my issue. Ow. Okay, there goes one of the bats. No, I don't I don't think they heal the bats. I think it seems like they might heal them. But if they do, they certainly don't heal them much. At least we can leave at any point. We know where the exit is. But I will gladly farm a whole bunch of money off of these things. Okay, I'm gonna have to play something that doesn't play keyboard and mouse next, though. Or something slower. Or Meteor Fall would be nice, but I think I'm gonna have to hold off on that. I got too many other games to play. I say. Oh, I guess it... I have, like, five JRPGs that have landed in my plate lately, and... Problem is, I've, like, recently kind of forsworn JRPGs in general. Uh, because I'm still not done with all the previous ones. Like, I still gotta go back and finish, uh... I don't know. We've been this way. Still haven't finished Dragon Quest XI, which is... Which was, like, my original goal. And then I've got that, like, uh... That Atelier game from Koei Tecmo and, like, one or two others. I'm just like, ah, time... And then there's all the other new indie games that I gotta finish or play or check out or something. Okay, good. No summoners, just good old-fashioned boars and beasties. I was hoping for more materials out of this place. 
and I've seen pretty much nothing. Yeah, JRPGs are long. Which, you know, I could work with if I wasn't streaming and recording them. The problem is streaming and recording all the, the JRPGs that I want to play. Or am given, it's just like, how do I do that? I almost feel like I need a separate channel that's just like, Wander plays JRPGs. I could do it. But I'm not sure if it would be worth, worth it. Ooh, what is that? Height scraps. Well, it's worth something. Let's see, is my controller recharged yet? Oh, the the batteries have already been charged. I uh, so I use an Xbox One controller generally when I'm when I'm playing video games, and uh, for that I just have a battery charger. So whenever I run out, I just swap uh, one set of batteries for the next, and then you know pop the dead ones back into the charger. And so I pretty much never run out of power. It's just a matter of like. I don't really want to get up and go to the other side of the room. Just to, uh, just to be able to play something on a controller right now. I should, and I need Evan to if I do anything else, but still. In his quest. What will he learn after he's had some rest? Okay, do more damage while unlucky. You learn faster when you have high bad luck. Or recover willpower when helping others. Let's do learn faster when you have high bad luck. Because my bad luck is pretty high. Okay. Uh, let's see. Can you bring me something? Something strong. I'll bring that next time. Thank you, bird creature. And what can we forge? Okay. Uh, we have gold ore. So what does that do? Does critical wounds. Now we don't actually want to do gold ore. We want to do bronze ore. 